Weird things that are normal in your country. Germany. You can legally drink beer at the age of 16. India. Purchasing huge amounts of gold ornaments during festivals. And also, you call strangers uncle and auntie. England. You call people announce for the most random things. And also, you argue about scones. Sweden. Literally having every single type of food in tubes. Portugal. Okay, tell me if it's true. Every time a Portuguese athlete wins a medal at the Olympic Games, your president calls them to congratulate them even faster than the athlete's mother. Denmark. On a person's 25th birthday, if they are not married, you strip them naked and coat them with cinnamon. Indonesia. When someone is lost in the mountain, river, lake or beach, people related to mystical things. Ukraine. Okay, here's plenty of them. Giving tips to doctors in form of money or chocolate. Building hell machine in home to make vodka. And finally, having two Christmases and three Santa Clauses. Argentina. You put an empty bottle on top of a car to indicate that it's for sale. Italy. Okay, Italians, let's be honest. You complain about Italy but can't stand when a foreigner does it. <laughs> also, you use grannies on the balconies as surveillance cameras. Same applies for Russia, Greece and pretty much all of Eastern Europe. Lithuania. It is normal in your country to complain about people who don't vote, but then not vote yourself. Bangladesh. In football, you support Argentina and Brazil more than your own country, and you can debate all day long who's the best. Ireland. Yeah, using death as a main topic of conversations in a similar way to talking about the weather. Welcome to Ireland. Turkey. You complain about how messed up the economy is, yet you still vote for the ones who messed it up. Also, you Turkish people love watching constructing machines working. Mexico. Not eating watermelon after 8pm cause it can cause stomachache, but being perfectly fine with eating 10 plus tacos at the same hour or even later. Chile. You Chileans say po at the end of almost every sentence. Belgium. Every beer that is brewed in your country has its own unique glass which is more than 1000. Brazil. In Brazil, it was common for family-friendly shows to have half-naked sexy dancers until the 90s, but now they stopped doing it. By the way, everyone uses flip-flops, even the vice president. Iceland. Oh god, are you ready? People eat fermented sharks in Iceland. Colombia. Yeah, in Colombia, it's very normal to dip cheese into hot chocolate. But for real, like, what the heck? Malaysia. When people say thank you to you, you must reply with thank you. Venezuela. It is very normal to see someone with a wheelbarrow in a bank. Canada. You make more conversations about the weather than politics. Russia. It's normal to wear a jacket in Siberia because it's not as cold as everyone thinks. Poland. Oh god, here we go. You applause for the pilot after takeoff and touchdown. You must invade every YouTube video that has the word Poland in its title. Literally everyone puts Pope John Paul II everywhere. And finally, you complain about the country but you're actually proud of it. Kazakhstan. You've got two New Years, first one in January and the other in March. Thailand. Building tiny houses for ghost gods and all holy creatures and offering them red fanta? Estonia and Finland. Since I'm Estonian, let me tell you. We go full naked into a hot room and start beating each other with sticks and leaves. Then we jump into snow and make snow angels with balls. But you know what? The Finnish also have another cool tradition. Combining two deadly substances, ammonia and chlorine, then eating it as a candy called salmiakki. Hungary. It's normal when the family comes together to see how the local butcher cuts down the family's pig. It's normal to sprinkle girls with a bucket of water in Easter morning. And it's normal to sing your national anthem at New Year's Eve midnight when you're fully drunk. Grease. Smashing plates in a wedding dinner or in a really special occasion party. But for real, all jokes aside, I wanna experience this. Uruguay. 
Basically a civil war because of two football teams, huh? You know, fifth time this week already. Peru! If someone on the street asks you for time, you don't know it, but you've already lost your phone and your, your watch. La puta madre! Bosnia and Herzegovina saying, where are you? And here I am as a greeting. Spain saying Jesus after somebody sneezes. South Africa. Your taxis and minibuses don't have to obey any traffic rules. Australia. Wearing a bike helmet when you go walking, so when magpies attack you, you don't get your eyeballs taken out. Iran. Tell me if it's true. It is very normal to see people driving in five lanes in a three lane highway during traffic. Romania. You eat soup every single day. Denmark. When insulting people, you never raise your voice. It comes across as a more subtle, you my friend are a f It tends to hurt more because it means whatever you say is completely serious. Japan. Whenever someone randomly says thank you, then for no reason at all, you have to say it back. And also, will you wash my underwear is a marriage proposal. To the Japanese, this means that the man trusts the woman enough to wash one of his most private possessions. France! In France, milk is stored at room temperature. And eating snails and complaining about everything is what you love to do. Serbia! In Serbia, parents call their daughter Sine, which means son. Sri Lanka. You get a holiday for every full moon day. Oh, what a luck. The Netherlands. Yeah, it's normal to celebrate birthdays in a circle of chairs with a coffee table in the middle. Also, having 1000 kids arrive at school on bikes in 15 minutes every day at every single school. And that's because you have more bicycles than people. Czech Republic. You guys are the single country in the world to use the letter ESH. Secondly, beer is cheaper than water. And finally, on Easter morning, boys start whipping girls with some random sticks. Tradition says that you do it for women healthness. Yeah, right. Egypt. In Egypt, bread is life. Its name literally means life. There are eight different types of bread and they saying that a meal without a bread will never make you full. Slovenia. You guys make alcohol out of everything. Apples, yes. Flowers, yes. If it has potential, you will make it alcohol. Listen, if Slovenia was an African country, animals would go extinct because you would hunt them for alcohol. Austria. Everyone seems to know the movie Sound of Music besides Austrians. They only know it because United States Americans talk about it. Bulgaria. In Bulgaria, it's okay to put milk first and then cereal. Norway. Norwegian slow TV is a popular thing there. For example, you guys follow the 134 hour voyage of a ship traveling from Bergen to Kirkenes. It's also normal to watch a 7 hour broadcast of a pork belly roasting in the oven at Christmas. Jordan. You like to float on the Dead Sea for relaxation and use their minerals as free cleaning products. North Korea. Hmm, weird things. Everything that might sound normal for Kim, if you get it. Lebanon. Hearing English, French and Arabic in the same sentence or conversation. Croatia. In Croatia, Rakia is considered to be the magic fix of any trouble in that country. Armenia, the only country in the world to have mandatory chess classes in grade school. Bangladesh, while most countries of the world have four seasons, Bangladesh has six. Summer, rainy, autumn, late autumn, winter and spring. But due to climate change, it has already lost two of them. Bulgaria, in Bulgaria, your mom can call you mom too. This also applies for fathers, grandparents, aunts and uncles. Uzbekistan. It's normal to have a few 100 guests in every wedding and divide it into two parts. The first is for men only and the second is the main one, including women. Bhutan. It may not sound weird, but Bhutan is the only country in the world with no traffic lights. Greenland. 
The weird thing is that the country is called Greenland, yet there is no green grass on the island, just a bit near coastal towns. Nepal? Yeah, male friends holding hands while walking is totally normal in Nepal. The Philippines, celebrating Christmas and Halloween at the same time. Belarus, someone speaking Belarusian to you and you have no idea what they're saying. Also, having no rights and being under the same guy for nearly three decades. China, having fake Apple stores all over China, taking the term high street ripoff to a whole new level. The employees will legitimately pretend to be Apple geniuses in order to try and sell you these false products. You'd think that this would lead to more and more people cracking down on the idea to make sure it doesn't continue to happen but there are still a whole bunch of the shops around. Sometimes even the staff themselves are led to believe that it's real. Georgia. Seeing dogs absolutely everywhere. There are two main reasons for having so many homeless animals. The lack of legislation and the low level of public awareness in the country. New Zealand. While Georgia may have many dogs, New Zealanders are used to seeing sheep absolutely everywhere. The sheep population peaked at just over 70 million in 1982. By 2020, numbers had dropped to 26 million, which is still incredibly high. South Korea! Oh yes, the country famous for K-pop and plastic surgeries. But did you know that South Koreans will always be one year older than you? In Korea, you're already one year old when you are born. The pregnancy period is rounded up to a year and counted as a year of life. If this video gets 10,000 likes, I will go to the sauna and run around my house fully naked. Uh, yeah, I'm not kidding. 10,000 likes, okay? Bye.